Uh, today, I am proud to sponsor the Spending Reduction Act, uh, which replaces the sequester in the first year with responsible cuts that protect our national security and adds an approximate $200 billion in additional savings for deficit reduction. Now, the bill is designed to stop fraud, to eliminate waste, uh, and frankly, uh, to replace uh, the sequester that is indiscriminate in its cuts. Again, aimed at trying to promote national security, but also to drive towards the underlying issue that faces this country, which is the mounting deficit and load of debt that we're going to leave this generation and the next. Uh, we are committed in the House, as you know, uh, to address the underlying problem, which is the spending. Uh, and that's why we're bringing this bill forward. Uh, together with our vote today to extend permanent tax relief in the middle class for the middle class and small businesses, we House Republicans are taking concrete actions to avoid the fiscal cliff. Absent a balanced offer from the President, this is our nation's best option. And Senate Democrats should take up both of these measures immediately. And the President has a decision to make. He can support these measures or be responsible for reckless spending and the largest tax hike in American history. I'll take some questions. Mr. Leader, one, yes. first up, do you think you have the votes to pass plan among Republicans? Yes, we're going to have the votes uh, to pass uh, both uh, the tax, permanent tax relief bill as well as the spending reduction account. And then, 